Alright, and so we have returned. Um, last time we finished off, um, yeah, we finished off Roxanne and Rustboro, and now we're going to go and do the, the Devoncore, um, uh, event in Rustboro. Yeah, so I just checked out uh, one of the new episodes of the uh, South Park on on its latest season, the Dead Kid, uh, the Dead Kids episode, and damn, that thing pissed me off. It didn't piss me off um, because Cartman is an asshole. No, I've I've almost gotten over to the point where I accept that Cartman is always going to be an asshole, and it's going to be frustrating forever. Uh, but it actually pissed me off because, as far as I can tell, they specifically cast Sharon as the villain. And I'm like, but Sharon actually has a great goddamn point, and it's not fair. She should not be the villain here. <laughs> and and the rest of the town is, and the rest of the town just refuses to uh, refuses to acknowledge that uh, well that bad shit is happening. A seal. Itchy arms. But yeah, the uh, the goal today is hopefully to do uh, all of Duford and and land in Slateport. That's what this session is mostly for. Sharp beak, booyah. And with that, once we get a once we get a flying uh, sweeper, we'll have uh, we'll have additional damage on that. A Bulbasaur. And burn finishes him off. I forget if there is, uh... I, I actively forget if there is um, an item in this uh, patch of grass. I think that there is, honestly, but I don't remember where. Corsola. Decent amount of cash. I really should have cut on somebody, specifically Sneasel, but I don't want to put cut on Sneasel over anything right now. I want to save Sketch for uh, learning a, a decent physical move. Specifically, I want to save it for either uh, for either Magnitude or Earthquake if I can. I know that's um, I know that's uh, requesting to keep it for uh, for way too long, way longer than I should. But if I can replace it uh, with Magnitude or Earthquake, that'll be really, really good uh, later on. Yes, yes, you will. With your, you know, steel types, probably. Kangaskhan. Kangaskhan is cool. Uh-oh. 
resistant to fire. And, ooh, a Sceptile. Resistant to flying. With Harden. So honestly, you he might actually be a rock type. No, he's not. Doesn't that yeah, that makes a uh, Sceptile electric. Alright. Probably electric bug. No, no, not electric bug. Electric ice? Yeah, electric ice. Yes, we uh, we have to help the uh, we have to help him. No. Is there an item down here? I always forget if there is. All right. So our first cave. Okay, I had to check to make sure that my audio was actually recording. I did a test recording before, and I sounded alright. And a seal. I love that we have uh, uh, Blast Burn this early. Yay! We got the Deafen Goods again. Thank you, Mr. Briny. Let's see. What kind of Pokemon do we have here? ho -Oh! ho 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 is interesting. Not something I actually want to fight, but, you know. ho ho is cool. And he's got Trace, too. enough to not actually encounter... Nope. Oh well. We need to go heal up. Poliwag. I think Poliwag is speed, but I really don't need uh, the additional experience right now. We are slightly overleveled. We are supposed to take down Brawly, I think, at either 18 or 19. Thank you for the additional Great Ball. Eventually, I'll start using those in order to ca capture more Pokemon. Mm, hello, Mr. Stone. Yes, we will uh, we will deliver your le uh, the letter to your son. The Pokemon League champion. Yay, we got the Pokenap. I don't think we have the Versus Seeker function available on it yet. I think we have to wait until after either Flannery or Norman for that thing to activate. And it's very troublesome. Alright. Um, I don't think we get any items by talking to these persons, but... Yeah. Small Easter egg.
match call. Yes. Stalker, uh, Stalker, Mr. Stone. Now, on our way back to Newford, there are several trainers that we have to go and chat with in order to... We rest, we've already healed up, uh, thanks to uh, Mr. Stone. But we want to save again, because this, uh, this fight can be a bit of an issue for us. And I do want to do this fight, I just expect to lose it. doesn't have a Rayquaza. And then she one-shots me with Bone Ray. So now we have to heal again. Hmm. Thank you for the info, Miss May. We got cut, and we and uh, Gen Three is one of the few generations where you don't actually ever need to use cut. And it's actually pretty awesome. You have to use the surf and strength a lot. Well, surf specifically because you know everyone's uh, biggest uh, gripe with Gen with the uh, Gen 3 games is there's too much water, and I'm like, but, uh, but you know, having too much water is actually a good thing, given uh, one of the main themes of the, uh, of the game is. Last Haley, and you, right, Winston. Yep, Rich Boy, Winston. There. There's one of the two major uh, uh, money dumps in the game. Wait, well, yeah, I'm supposed to talk to you to get bullet seed. I forgot. I forgot to do that. Mm. Okay, he gave us the TM for Razor Wind instead. All right. I have done the randomization for uh, for TMs, uh, not HMs, because because uh, you know you're required to have surf. Lady Cindy, alright. And do I want the. Uh, I'm gonna sleep, no. Uh, uh, Cindy and Winston are the main ones that I need. We'll need them for money later, if we ever need money. Hey, Norman. And I think we also get a call from Mom, right? Not yet? Alright. Alright, so a couple of things that we need to do in Newford. We need to get the silk scarf. We also need to get the old rod. Yay. And we also need to check a couple of the uh, items thrown about.
is it right here? I could have sworn that there was an item on the side, but apparently not. A tentacruel Mega Beam might have a bit of a problem with this. No. Shit, resistant to normal, that, that pretty much guarantees. That he's a rock or steel. Well, let's just test for steel. No, nope, he's rock. Alright, and Tentacruel is a really good special tank. Also, Tentacruel is a pretty good special sweeper, at least in Gen 1. I've told that story too many damn times, though. I actually prefer uh, fishing in a, um, in a lake as opposed to a sea or stream. Lake fishing is where it's at. Hello, Flygon. You're a good physical sweeper, although you're actually a mixed sweeper. I kind of want to go take down Brawly first. Yeah, let's try and go take down Brawly first. That way, we can, that way uh, in the event that we catch an HM slave, we can um, uh, teach it Flash. I never remember the, the fastest path through, uh, through this gym. I think this is a double battle. Throw. No, it's not. All right. Jump Luff. Jump Luff is terrible and is only useful as a support Pokemon. have uh, 
And we don't have a paralyzed heals yet. So we'll take so we'll try and take that one more trainer and then we'll go heal. Because we are at full health after all. We're just paralyzed. I do believe we're pretty much right next to Brawly, though. You know, in a linear fashion, not in a, not in a uh, not in an actual distance fashion. So what? Uh, okay, he's just gonna spam lock on at us. All right. Super effective heat wave. Yes, I am vastly overpowered. Uh, yep, here's Broly. Okay. Alright. Save. Let's go. But you were supposed to go heal first. I know, I know, but I really don't think that Broly's gonna, uh, gonna have that much uh, that I'm not, that I'm actively afraid of. Oh look, it's a Typhlosion! Don't tell me that the that the Gen 2 fully evolved forms are gonna be the bane of my existence this run. Zangoose is. Come on, Brawly. Tell me where Zangoose is. And he's a flying type, too. A flying type with Howl. Man. Skull Bash. Now we'll probably lose this one then. Yep. Nah. Hey, yeah. We can totally take him down. It's just that you know we uh, went uh, went in there really, really low. Oh, whilst uh, whilst we have a moment, where is Angus? I must know. You will tell me a national Pokedex. Zigzagoon, Route, Shroomish, Whismur, Nosepass, Sableye, Plusle, Torkoal, Flygon. Here, Zangoose. Oh, um, that's Duford Cave. Ooh, 
uh, Duford Cave, the Safari Zone, um, <sighs> fuck it, Victory Road, and the path leading to uh, Evergrande. Wow, it's actually a lot of different zones. All right, let's let's go see if we can actually go and get Zangoose. I want Zangoose. We're, we're, we're only going to check this uh, this first uh, this first floor of Granite Cave, but the HM for Flash. Yay! Yeah. Mine it. Mine is cool, but now we're. we're we are here for. I think we'll do 10 spawns on the first floor. It's one. Pelipper. Pelipper is honestly a great mixed Pokemon, honestly. I, I'm i not going to use Pelipper this run, because I use Pelipper in almost every run of Gen 3. Lumberry... for Poliwag. That's really weird, actually. Um, that means that um, that the Duford Cave is actually in the... Uh, well, rather, Granite Cave is way later on in the enemy list. Huh. And, or rather, in the spawn list. And, uh, ooh, Charizard! No, we're not gonna, we're not gonna run Charizard, because everyone runs the starters. It's four... Should have considered fighting it though, because speed. Uh, I think it uh, charges on speed and special attack. And Mew. Mew is one of everything, just like Arceus. So, no, Mew, uh, farming on Mew is not really a good idea. Uh, six. Seven. Ah, hell, let's take down the Charizard. Definitely worth the experience, at least. Eight. I'll be honest, I'm pretty sure that Zangus is going to be in either floor two, uh, floor 2 or 3. Nine. I think mine is actually special defense over a special attack, but I'm not sure. Alright, and this should be 10. Yep. Oh, hello, Dratini. Horrible to see you here. Evil frickin' Dratini. Alright. So, unfortunately, we did not find Zangus. Oh, well. I always end up using Pelipper as a special sweeper. Mostly because, although, although it's not as true in Gen 3, um... Pelipper gets um, an absurd, uh, just an absurd amount of uh, decent coverage moves. I know he gets air cutter. Uh, later on, he gets scald. He gets surf. He gets dive. Pelipper gets a lot of really amazing stuff, and he's honestly one of the best HM slaves in the game. All right, so let's attempt to go take down Brawly again. And here, okay. This time we're not paralyzed, so we should uh, we should totally be able to take down uh, uh, his angus this time. Oh, 
Hello, Typhlosion. I think you're actually a grass type, right? No, you are not. Oh well, Twin Needle still two shots you, so. Ow! The bastard's actually got fucking twin. Not like got counter. Man. That is Blast Burn. Shit, resistant to fire. Not good, not good. Nah. Resistant to fire and part flying. Uh, should we try for the crit? Honestly, no. Let's just go for more damage. It's okay, Megumi. You did your job. I'm just... Uh-oh. Citrus Berry! <sighs> Shit. Well, we lose again. Yeah, we need Razor Wind to do a crit. Yeah, because you still have Fire Punch, don't you? Yeah. And that Sneasel's actually weak to fire. Well, crap! Do we seriously need to go and, and get another Pokemon for Brawly? Ugh! A phys I need a physical attacker with... Well, well, shit. That would have to be a rock-type physical attacker. Hmm. Um, from what we saw, uh, there aren't any real uh, physical attackers here. So how about here? Tend to go through a granite cable uh, whilst we are hunting. Hell, uh, Zangus is a great physical attacker, and if he's actually a rock type, that would uh, really help us out. Illumis. has returned. Isn't there? No. Mm, skip bloom. Bleh. I love having the smoke ball at the moment. Although, admittedly, uh, the uh, big problem that the smoke ball has for me right now is the fact that it actually has a, a much more lengthy animation than I would prefer to, to de be dealing with. But Guaranteed Flea is very nice. Evil Skip Stardust, more cash. Actually, well, we should check our cash right now. Yeah, we're down to 16. Ugh. That's not quite enough to buy five Great Balls. Need to 
be careful here because the uh, the ramp back down is just down there. Hey, Anma. Ah. Yang. Yanma has present as well. But the important thing about Yanma is that it gives speed EVs. I think it's dedicated speed EVs, like it's two. There we are. Ooh, Dust Talks. I think Dust Talks is special defense EVs. I honestly don't know. Dustox is a Pokemon that I that I uh, frequently do not end up using. Despite the fact that I love Butterfree, and Dustox is pretty much just a weak uh, Butterfree. is a different spawn in general, so there's one. We're gonna do ten spawns looking for Zangoose. Ooh! Espeon! I never run Espeon. Mostly because it's a pain in the ass to get, but I don't need a special attack right now. I need another physical attacker. Espeon is great, though. Plume is mostly a tank, which is why she is terrible, because grass type tanks don't work. They are weak to too many types. It's the same reason why ice type tanks don't work, weak to too many types. Four. Ooh, Noctowl. Noctowl is a Pokemon that's just mostly a regional bird. He never decided on what he actually wanted to do with his life. I mean, he gets a lot of really interesting support uh, support skills, but that's about it. Uh, Grambles actually actually tries to be a physical sweeper, but he's too slow to he's too slow to get it done. Six Meryl. Aww. If I thought for a moment I could get a Zoomeril at the moment, I would definitely go for that, but no. I don't want to do the boatload of grinding that I would have to do in order to get a Zoomeril. But then again, a Zoomeril only actually works because of huge power, which. More than, why is there another Feebass here? <sighs> at seven. But Azumarill mostly only works because of the because of huge power. Without huge power, Azumarill, you know, is just kind of bulky. Ooh, Kangaskhan. Kangaskhan is really well rounded. Nah, we'll pass. Again at nine. One more spawn, and then we'll attempt to go take down Pony again with a slightly different strategy. And ten Ninkata. Ninjask actually has like a super, a superbly amazing speed, but that's about it. And since the only uh, good bug type move at the moment is is uh, Mega Horn. It suffers a lot because of that. Oh well. We looked for Zangoose and we did not find him. Come 
mine and... You know what I could do? I could switch out... I could. What I could do is I could switch out um, the charcoal for the silk scarf on a Magby and attempt to have Maguni uh, sweep the Zangoose with Hyperfang instead. It's not likely to work all that well, but Hyperfang's increased critical hit chance makes me, uh, makes me think that it's at least, it's, it's at least something I can try. Stay on the sneeze, uh, not the Zangus, the Tyrogue. But yeah, Blast Form, the Typhlosion, Munch out the Tyrogue, stay on Sneasel to uh, attempt to Razor Wind Zangus down a bit. And then uh, attempt to sweep him with a uh, Hyper Fang. With the additional level, this should, this should hopefully work. Honestly, I should probably be trying to poison him, but even if I uh, even if I landed uh, a, a decent poison, uh, the the end result would probably not be all that much different. Uh oh! Ouched! All right, Mega Me. Let's hope this works. have access to uh, Pluck, um, because Pluck doesn't exist yet. I'm not entirely sure what else I can honestly try. Maybe I should just be trying to get, uh, trying to get the burn down to reduce, uh, to reduce his damage. Sirskit.
Arrow Blast? Why does Sir Skid have Arrow Blast? Silk Scarf, that's probably how we should do this. But it sounds like this is where I wish I really had, like, Spark or Thunderbolt. A single Spark would take down that Zangus right now, no questions. Uh, no questions about it. But only technically. We're not grinding on purpose. because he was stupid. He's not he's not up to his defense at all. We're not burned. Shit. Just need a crit. This is why Gen 2 had the damn bank. Yeah, it was your mom, but still, it was a bank. Docile locomotive. What's in? Um, I'm not actually all that frustrated. Uh, 
Like, even though I feel like I should be. Because that's what that, that's effectively what, uh, what we're doing right now, just ramming our head, uh, ramming our head against Brawly over and over again. Now, hoping for a crit that is that just flat out isn't happening. Defense and Skull Bash? hit on Hyperfang. Now we win. But we need that crit really badly. And we missed. We missed twice in a row. Congratulations, game. You, cheat, uh, you cheated us out. It didn't even cheat us out the normal way, where we just flat out weren't getting our crit. You cheated us out with missing twice. No, we totally can win this fight, and we don't honestly need the crit. No, we don't need the crit as badly as I'm making it sound. However, um, if he goes in the skull bash at any point, then we need the crit. I just want to get to Slate for this split. I thought it would be the Typhlosion that was, that was going to be our big uh, stopping point, but no. It's this out. It's this absolutely amazing Zangus that I don't have that I don't have a good answer for. If Zangus wasn't a flying type, then we could use Muncha on him. And um more and then more than likely. Uh, that would be that would be enough. Oh look, fire punch.
Now, a die would need a crit on Razor Wind in order, in, in order to, uh... Oh! We got the crit on Razor Wind, and it was enough damage. Yay! There. We gambled for crits, and it worked. Eventually. We're broke. We got the knuckle badge by ramming our knuckles into Broly over and over again until it worked. Now please be fire punch. Nightmare. Cool. Unfortunately, we don't have anyone that can actually fix sleep yet. But with that, that should close out the split because next we're going to sleep port. We should go heal first, though. I'm not yet. I'm not yet, uh, encountered all that many ghost type Pokemon, which is kind of sad. We're going to sleep port, and now Mom should call us. Really? Still no? Yes. Thank you. And... Yes, yes it does. I forget where... This is. But there is an item on this beach some damn way. No, we're not gonna go uh, go after all of it, but Okay, I missed it. Yay, we made it to Slate Port. Um and it's Right? Nope. The powder jar. Hi, Roxanne. Yes, yes, it does. Oh, that's right, the battle tent. I promise not to spend too much time in the battle tent, although it's pretty much the best way to get full heals. The museum is packed.
the Soothe Bell. Mm -hmm. That'll allow us to have yet a higher friendship rating with our Pokémon. Uh, sure. That is not important, but, you know. Ooh, the move return. I actually do really want that, but not now. I want return to go on to sneeze over Razor Wind. Okay, unfortunately, I... Um, we need to go over to... I want to check the Pokemon Center first. But we need to spawn the event to make the uh, Team Aqua Grunts get out of the hell, get out of the freaking way. Which requires us to talk, not to this guy, but the guy upstairs. supposed to talk to him? Okay. I thought it was uh, I thought it was this guy up here. No, he's just the guy that tells us about buoyancy. Buoyancy is pretty awesome. But yeah, we have landed in Slateport, and that is honestly where we're going to uh, cut off today. Quite clearly, I need to pick up a third Pokemon uh, for my team. Another special attacker, prefer preferably. Yes, I would like to rest up my Pokemon, despite the fact that they did not engage in any combat on the way in the sleep port. <sighs> but yeah, we're done for now. Um, next split, I want to get into and beat. I want to get into Mallville and beat Watson. Yeah, Watson is next. All right. Be safe, everybody.